I wonder how insulting it would be to a rich person if you see like some kind of a um a pass of some kind going from one city to the next and you ask if that's their bus pass instead of their plane ticket okay I think I laid down close to 10 minutes on my mat on my back and wow my left rib cage hurts when I breathe when I inhale but I gotta say it feels better having stood up it actually feels like I'm stretching things out and I was in agony again last night in this car seat I just want to rip it out. I don't, I, I can't deal with it at all. All right, so we got the Ghost King or the Gold King. And they're advertising that you go this way to get to there. With the brochure. I don't see any brochures. I thought they had a skeleton in this driver's seat. Whoops. <laughs> I guess not. This downtown is really fascinating. This is, I think, the main downtown area. Maybe there's another very popular area on the lower level. But what an amazing setup here. They just had like all kinds of different functions at one time, and then they built on top of that, and built on built on top of a few different functions to really give this layered or this multi-functional appearance like some functions you question what they were for at one time this is a park I go up above and I'll see a park the mine museum it looks like it should be free it looks like they're more about selling things did I miss something? Right, so I'll just go up. There's some reading over here. That's what I think I was concerned about. <clears throat> I go up this these stairs, and there's stairs over there. But they actually found room to put a park on this upper level. It's kind of interesting. <laughs> Hotel Connor over there, 1898. Why do they have this stadium seating for the road? Must be for uh, special events. 7. I don't think it's 7 yet. I might have violated their hours. They put up Christmas lights already. Look at this caged area. Oh, it's a one-way road. Okay. I thought this is a two-way road. <laughs> wow. <laughs> what is going on over there? They don't really do much of anything. Multi-level with various rooms, but... There's pennies and there's nickels. Oh my god, there's quarters and pennies and nickels. What? There must be like a hundred dollars of pennies, quarters, and nickels in there. People are just throwing money in. Bank vault? <clears throat> I don't get it. The Bartlett Hotel? Alright, so why are people throwing so much spare change in there? Is that for the Svab family? And they're putting stickers up all over the place. <laughs> what? What is the deal? They make, they just, they're so general. Look at that, they're just, can that be seen, all that money? You want to get in there and take it all. They got all this locked up pretty good. People just fling quarters and all kinds of money in here. Is that like their way of trying to encourage uh, it to be redeveloped? 
because it maybe have burnt down. <clears throat> I don't want you going in there. There's all kinds of corridors. These must be individual businesses. At one time, there were probably individual businesses <clears throat> that <clears throat> they just locked up. Yeah, these these certainly would have been businesses. Uh, just art, art projects. Bedtime at the Bartlett. That can be even seen. And then this smells very smoky, so they're smoking a lot of food. Yeah, I think that's uh, the main, the main road. But it's a one-way. I was thinking maybe I could park down there. All these stickers. Letter junkies. <laughs> Bobby D's historic. Okay. Oh, there's parking, but I know that's gonna fill up during the day. They just they clear out completely at night. <clears throat> Right, walking away from that that mysterious old uh, setup, I just want to get a closer look at the blast furnace. Old safe made a kind of a concrete. Where people throw their cigarettes. This is the blast furnace. <clears throat> the blast furnace was in use in 1882. Okay. <clears throat> oh, you got grinding wheels and stuff. <clears throat> That's garbage can now, huh? Haunted hamburger. Okay, I can go up to the next level on these stairs. I think that also connects to the to the um the park. This is the police station. They got a cop car. Lawman killed. <clears throat> Please do not obstruct the use of sidewalks. Discharge firearms. Okay. And then they got a little display. I don't know if like skeletons are the year round decoration or if they just haven't pulled them down for, for Halloween yet. <clears throat> Mile high. <clears throat> See, this parking was looking interesting. This is a one-way road, and there's like, what, like almost 10 cars overnight. Maybe because they're sleeping in the Haskins apartments or up above the businesses or something. <clears throat> parking is tough. I think where I parked, I, I squeezed somebody out of their spot. <laughs> and... Uh, yeah, I have to wonder where the heck they they parked. <clears throat> Cuz I'm going to have to consider another alternative option. I just moved my car. Please no ice cream. Yeah, it's oh, there's a stairway. Let me take a look at that. <clears throat> this one-way road. And then the other one way is this. So you can kind of go in a circle. You can park below. They mark the parking with fire hoses. I've seen that in Sedona. Kind of for the first time. I, I don't recall. I think I might have seen that type of parking elsewhere. Laurel Williams Park. <clears throat> so it's like they... They seem to have buildings that are 
Oh man, this is a one way. <laughs> I was about to say, you're not going to be approaching this way. <laughs> Safeway? Groceries? I had an old Safeway in here. Huh. So, uh, I don't see any, any sign that you can read about Safeway. The first Safeway, where was that? I saw like a sign in one city. It was like somewhere in Oregon. <clears throat> yeah, that build, see that building is closed down. The gallery is open. That building over there, the red bricks, looks like it might be local traffic only. So if I did want to ride around in here, they don't want anybody, any tourists coming in. Huh. They want you to take a left. So yeah, right now I'm entering into more residential. And yeah, I was gonna capture it. I think it's further down. There's a sign loaded with stickers. Just make sure they're all in the back. <laughs> yeah, so this is all, all the one way. Kate's books, gifts and chocolates. Please watch your step. Oh, okay, right there's private stairway. They encourage you to come over here. They gotta make sure that you you know where the private areas are. <clears throat> Monday only Monday? Got a corrugated roof. It's only Thursday through Monday. Oh, they focus on the weekends. Huh. <clears throat> yeah, and then like the, the town hall is up here. I was looking for other parking options, but maybe <clears throat> on this, this is all a one way I was considering, which is, mm, it's such a maze. I have more to learn about the, the driving. Looks like maybe they're doing some work inside there. <clears throat> They've, they've really turned this place into such a maze. I mean, there's stairways I didn't expect. This is like, this is an area that's definitely enjoyable to, to walk around because it's such a maze. Like, I just learned, I just went down these stairs here. There are stairs I didn't really understand, I didn't know about. Wow, that water just keeps running. Oh, they don't want you even walking up here. Wow, really? They don't want you walking up to the, the back side of this uh, town hall library. Okay, I, I could park here. This is the one way that goes into the residential. This is a very possible to park overnight. <clears throat> Just got to deal with the one way and learn how that works. Cause I really wanted to Jerome Art Walk. <clears throat> so I really wanted to like have options besides where I was at. I kind of want to look around this area some more. This car looks abandoned. <laughs> what the heck?
Maybe they're still driving it. Tires are still full. Tires are still doing good. Maybe it's because it's really lightweight. Oh, 18 September, so it's expired. Here's one. <clears throat> okay, and I'm parked. Um, yeah, behind this building. That's where I'm at. This hotel is pretty prominent. Two, two very prominent buildings. Uh, yeah, I found a. Looks like a pretty good parking space. Go down below and oh my, there's a mine shaft right there. I wonder if that might be private, considered private property. That'd be kind of neat to check out. <clears throat> These people want their money so bad. They keep saying there's a fee, fee, fee. Fee area, what's, oh, seven dollars, jeez. Oh. Alright, just, uh, I guess taking a long way to get back to my, my car. Some dude's walking his dog off in the distance. Oh. <clears throat> yeah, they, they certainly cut into that mountainside. They cut into that. And you can see evidence. I can get a better angle. But there's also some old buildings. To support the the work, <laughs> just the roof, various works. Yeah, they cut into this mountainside pretty good. All right, so they had this winch here for some reason. I don't know if it has anything to do with the cutting they did and the stuff over there. I don't know if I could. How sturdy is that? Alright. There's like some... Yeah, this pile right here looks interesting. Cans? What like cans? And then... And then you can see... Oh, huh, that's not gonna work. Yeah. You can see the actual... You can see the green from the copper right there. They left a lot. They left some copper behind, I guess. <clears throat> yeah, this this wood structures are pretty neat looking. What what do they have going on there? Is that a mine cart? That's pretty neat. And a lot of cans, maybe. It's kind of hard to see through the trees, but it's more of what they cut. See the layers. Seems to me that they reached a pretty good copper area on the right. Why did they quit it? Did it was, is that just if it fell shorter than what they expected or something? Yeah, I never brought out my, well, okay, I did bring out the bicycle, but I never rode it. It's just so hilly around here. This area, <laughs> this would be a good stretch for the bicycle. We got some old piece of metal. Hard to tell what that would be for. They cut away the trees around it. They may have had to drive the Indians out of Jerome, but at least they didn't have to in Butte. What a mess of wood. And then they got metal. I guess it's all an effort to hold up the side. There's an obvious 
out of the door. <laughs> <coughs>